Let's get those blaze rods. Ah! Okay, crap, 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 crap. That is an enchanted. That is an enchanted. There's lots of explosions. <laughs> What is up, my awesome and amazing Sinjas? It's your boy, Mr. Cynical C. And what I have for you guys today, oh, I gave you a glimpse. What I have for you guys today is a new episode of a new series. No, I'm kidding. What I have for you guys today is another episode of Into the Madness. A lot has changed, guys. I've been working so hard. I've literally been working so hard for you guys. I've been playing so hard to get some of the coolest gear in the game for you guys. And I hope you're excited. Now, I know a lot of you guys are like, well, Cynical, this is long overdue. You suck. We don't like you. Well live with it look what i got i got forest armor now a lot of you guys were saying that i should have gone with essence armor and it was something that i intended to get initially well yes well that is extremely true let's sleep really quick now in order to get this i'm gonna run it through for you guys because a lot of you guys are probably wondering i know i can fly that's the best part of it but it also has amazing damage like amazing amazing damage but before we get into that i just want to show you kind of some of the cool things you run really fast uh, with this armor, you can also watch. Check out the water. Check out the water. I'm surfing. Professional surfer Kelly Slateson. Oh my God. I'm I'm a beast. Okay. I planted these earlier, and so I'm just getting that set back up. All right. See that? Don't tell me that that's not awesome. I fly. I'm mega quick. I just I have suave. And what this able allowed me to do after I got the armor was to get a little bit more lava. So I wasn't able to get much. Like as you can see, our tanks are almost empty. But I was able to get a little bit more down in the mines and just kind of go with that. Now I also made an epic sword. So there it is. It's a heat sword with damage five. Freezing and heat, so they're gonna burn while standing still while I give them damage. It's pretty sick. The only thing is, if you look at the green bar on the top left, it has a magic meter. So that magic meter runs out for everything that I do. But what I really want to show you is the rod of regeneration, or restoration. Every time I use this rod, I heal. Doesn't matter, I just heal. It's basically like drinking a potion, except for you heal. I also have a rod for night vision, and the way that I got these rods is by doing these achievements. So what happens is, I'll go to the last page. You see how these items are blocked out and it gives you a little, um, a little precursor as to what it's going to be? I had to figure that out for each of these. And basically what I did is I grinded through each of these items, I collected them, and I was able to get some pretty freaking epic stuff. Like, I'm talking really, 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 really epic stuff. And that's pretty much how we were able to get to where we are. Now, you may be asking yourself, why is this important, Cynical? Because in this episode, we are able to do a lot. We're going to get so much done, guys. The first order of operation is getting back in the nether, finding some blaze rods, so that we can and that we will be able to get a bunch of them so that we can go ahead and get an ender tank going so that we have an unlimited lava source but before we're able to do that we're going to need cookies because i like to eat cookies i just i love cookies do i have any cocoa beans no i have no cocoa beans do i have any roses yes i do i have seven all right what we're gonna do is take those roses let's grab our minium stone and this is where all the hard work begins ladies and gentlemen this is where it, this is where heroes are made there we go. Now, cocoa beans. Bam. Now, we're going to need to do is make some wheat. Wheat? Where are you, wheat? I may have to go grab some really quick. I don't know if it's one wheat for... Yeah, it is. Okay, so bam, bam. We get eight cookies for that. So, we're not going to need a lot of wheat. We're just going to need a few pieces. So, let's see. That should do us just some justice right there. Let's come back over here. Now, a lot of you guys are like, Cynical, you're just going so fast. It's because there's a lot to do today, and I'm super hyped. I'm just excited to be able to show you guys all the cool stuff to do. We have 16 cookies right there, and now let's see if we have it. La Papel paper. We have four paper. Uh, erm, ermy dermy. Uh, let's see if we have any logs yeah we do we do we have some forest logs here let's pulverize these really quickly and let's make some more oh i didn't mean to use my rod of regeneration see 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 that little heart by my name regeneration but let's see um hmm, logs all right guys i'll see you on the other side i'm gonna cook a full stack of 64 and it'll just take me just one moment i'll see you guys on the other side and yeah all right so i slightly changed my mind it's good to have all this paper though 
Regardless of the situation, it's not bad having a crap ton of paper. But the reason I changed my mind is because when I was looking at uh, the next build for the sword, we're going to have a damage 3 looting 4 sword so that we have a higher chance of getting more blaze rods. So I don't think that we need as many as I thought. Like, because I was going to do a holy crap load of looting. But then the thing is, weakening... Um, a mob is going to be mega killer hard. So instead of doing that, we'll just make it a decent sharpness, like a de sharpness three looting four sword. So this thing is insane and brawlic. It's going to do damage. Plus for like all the big mobs that are really hard to destroy, I have this one right here. Now what I want to do though is I want to pulverize some iron ore. Wait, let's see. I or gold ore. Gold. We have a bunch of the essence from our farm. And if we go ahead and go like this... It's going to start giving us actual essence. You see how we have 3,000 of those? Dudes, I have been working so hard. Every chance I get, I just take it, replant it. That's why it exploded. We had a giant explosion over there. But let's go ahead and take this, and I kind of don't even want to cook it, honestly, right now. So what we're going to do is go like that, and we'll waste a little coal. All right, we're just going to waste a little coal. It's not a lot at all. It's just going to be a few pieces. And the reason I'm doing this is because I want to be able to make a notch apple. And the reason why is because when we first get into the nether, I just want to ensure that we're able to survive. And god apples are god awesome. Am I right? I mean, if we take a block like this, go like this, and grab an apple, we're going to change the way the world knows us. Bam! We have ourselves a golden apple enchanted. Now, let's see. We have our looting, th wow, looting four, damage three sword. And then we also have our regular sword. We have a little bit of food. We have fire-resistant potions so that we're good for backup while we're out there. And we're not going to take too much damage because of how overpowered we are now. Like, all it takes is a little grind to get into the mad pack. And before you know it, you're just OP. You're just OP. You're just OP. I don't know if it has modular power suits, but this is the next best thing. So I think we're ready. We're just going to find another fortress. We actually probably should take some flint and steel because you know me. I'm probably going to die or get close to breaking the portal. So as soon as we can just fly out of spawn and go looking for stuff, the better. Because we're not going to we're not gonna land often. That's my goal, not to land often. So let's go ahead and... Hmm, we have our rod. We have our food. What do you guys say? Let's go and yeah, let's head in. Okay. I ate the apple before we went in. I'm a little nervous. That's the reason why I did that. We have a super good sword. We have super good supplies. Let's just hope for the best as soon as we get out of here. There we go. All right, we're looking for another fortress. Let's try not to... Let's stay mobile. What's up? What's up, buddies? All right, stay mobile. Uh, Nether fortress, where art thou? I have a mini-map. I probably could utilize that. It's just there's no... Uh, there's never any safe place to... Yep, stand in the mad pack. And that's the problem. You can never stop in one place. Okay. What's our meter at? All right. Watch that meter. If this meter go... Oh, I forgot where our house is. Balls. Okay. I'm just going to assume right next to where all those arrows are. But we need to find a um, nether fortress. So, hey, Impy. Hey, Impy Gimpy. How are you doing, dude? All right. Let's just stay down for a second. Let's not try to get out of hand. And okay. Hello, 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 um, I want to hit M, but, okay, do I see a fortress? That kind of looks like one right there. Let's keep pressing forward, and I'll know in about two seconds if that's actually, nope, that's not a force. That's not a fortune thingy, my doohickey. All right, let's see. Oh, wait, is it, is it, is it? No, it's not. Okay, this nether is so massive, dude, and it doesn't look like it has a lot of what we want quite yet. We're pretty much just trying to get blaze rods. So, guys, I'm going to go ahead, try to find a um, blaze spawner at some point, try to find a nether fortress, and I'll see you guys on the other side. And, yeah! All right, I found a spawner. I found one. I found one. All right, let's skip. We need eight blaze rods, so I'm going to go ahead and grind this out while we get eight. Um, just enjoy the music while your party is reached. Ah! Okay. Nope. 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 I was gonna do music, but then the ghast. Yeah. Okay. Nope. Nope. Not how I roll, shorty. Not how I roll. Okay. And nope. 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 Okay. Let's get those blaze rods. Okay. Crap. 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 That is an enchanted. That is an enchanted. There's lots of explosions. Big. 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 Holy balls. Okay. 
Oh my god, that was close. No, back off! Okay, okay. Okay, we're safe. We're still alive. We're still alive. Holy balls, that was insane. That was insane. Alright, let's eat really fast. Good god. Good god. Well, at least we're in a position where we can survive. That's all that really matters. Alright, I need... Okay, nope, that guy's enchanted. Ah! What the frick is that? That's a tarantula! Minecraft tarantula! Whoa! Holy balls. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do a tactical retreat. Even as OP as I am, we're gonna... We're just gonna... J, J, hey, what's up, buddy? How's the family? No, I'm not a scaredy cat. Shut up! Okay. Holy balls. Even with all this enchants and stuff, it's still mega sketchy. It is mega, mega sketchy. Holy gosh. How much of this it's eating through our forest so hard, too? I forgot to put any inside of our swords, which kind of sucks. So as soon as this sword breaks, it's gone. And I really don't want to fight the Mega Tarantula, so let's just go for the Blaze Rods. Blaze Rods me. Blaze Rod me! Okay, no, no, you can still see me. Okay, you can still see me. Alright, well, let's see. We have three. We need eight. Unfortunately, we need eight. So, guys, I will just try to destroy these as fast as possible because I'm mega scared. Ah! Okay, okay, okay. You know what? For this giant spider demon thing, we're just going to go like that. It's going to make babies, isn't it? Yep, I knew it. Ah! Ah! Too much, too much going on. Too much going on. Whoa, what the frick is that thing? Oh my god, oh my god! A mummy? Oh my god, King Pharaoh! Okay, okay, let's go, and... Ah! Ah! One more, yes, okay, we got two, I think, off that one. Alright, we're safe. Whoa, what the flippin' heck? I got lifted off the ground there. Alright, demon! Oh my god. Okay, we have eight! We have eight! Peace, we're done. Peace and hair grease. Okay, let's get out. Let's get out. How am I going to get out of here without getting hurt? All right, let's just run. Let's just run. All right, how long? much longer do I have fire resistance? Good thing I looked. I had it for like two seconds. I have it for eight more minutes. Let's get out while we can. All right. Trapped. I'm trapped in the closet. My name is R. Kelly, baby. All right, let's head back towards the way we can. Holy balls. Hello. Hello. Come on. Thank you. Okay, let's GTF out. Deadly do. Okay. I think this should be the way back towards base. So let's just get there. I'll see you guys on the other side. And... Alright, I'm not gonna yaw yet, because I'm kind of nervous. And if anything massively dangerous happens, I want you guys to be a part of it with me. But I think we should be good. We should be able to make it out of this alive. Holy balls. Alright, I need to... I gotta reevaluate my life from this point forward. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, uh... Please be an exit. Please be an exit. Please be an exit. Please be an exit. No, don't be a dead end. Dead end? No, don't be a dead end. I dead end. Dead freaking end. Was I here at some point? Oh my god. No, it's a dead freaking end. Okay, gotta go back. Gotta go fast. Rick and Bobby. Uh let's try going up. Up? No, not up. Okay. Uh okay, we're definitely lost. Alright, give me a second to find my way out of this, guys. I'll see you on the other side. And yeah! We are the champions! We are the champions! We got them. We got the blaze rods. We have nine. We have one more. So let's go look up an ender chest. And a boom. And a boom. Oh, we need to make cauldrons. Which it requires iron. Which we should have a decent amount of. We may not have a crap. Well, we have essence iron ore so even if we don't have a lot we can make a lot so that's always good let's get two cauldrons going and boom now we're going to need endothermic tanks which is going to require ender pearls which we have 11 of which is very fortunate but just in case i have a plan if we're going to run out we also need some obby obby city on so let's go ahead and make the endothermic tank in uh ender thermic thermic tank uh ender hyphen thermic tank yeah that's what it is i knew that i was testing you guys what are we missing uh we're missing this bam bam oh i didn't need to make eight but whatever and a pickaxe so bam bam wham bam thank you ma'am there we go and boom now uh eye of ender can we make that well we have one blaze rod left let's pulverize it to ensure we get the most out of it and get four and then let's bring it back over to the daddy-o and bam now let's go ahead and make the endothermic tank now we have the two pumps all we need now is the redstone engines i'm gonna go ahead and make those really fast guys so let's go ahead and grab some sticks uh do they make gears even though yes they do okay 
I don't know how many we're gonna need. Uh, do we have any more logs? We should have all the supplies we're gonna need for this operation. This is kind of a big day. Like, all the productivity in this episode is over 9,000 compared to what we've done in the past. Usually we would have died, tried again, died, tried again, died, tried again, cussed a little, died, tried again, died, died, died. But this is like full-on, um, episode of getting things done, engine. Come on, game. You know what I want. Do what I want, what I want with my body. Do it a won't, don't stop, let's party. Do it a won't, what with the bad anger? All right, let's go. And bam, let's go here. Let's slap this like that. Let's go and grab some iron, ironic real quick. And we need four, one, two, three, four. I hope we have enough glass in here. So let's see if we do glass. We should have that glass in the door. There we go. And let's make some gears. Bam, one. Wait a second. Oh, I was like, dude, I didn't know I ran out of anything. We have four. Perfect. Because one on each side, we're going to need four redstone. Redstone. Bam. We're going to need two of these. Oh, wait. We already have 11. My God. Are we prepared or what? We already have the engines ready. I guarantee you, if we have an endothermic, I'm going to be so pissed. I bet we do. Endothermic. No, we didn't. Good. All right. So we have all the things we need. Let's set this one up here real quick. And let's slap it on top. And I think it needs to... Oh, no. Okay. Well, let's grab a pickaxe. Let's grab a pickaxe. Silk touch. Nice. That's not a half bad steel, is it? And let's break you. I'm so surprised we survived that, man. That was like some next level stuff. So this one's set to white, white, white. It's our main source of power, so we'll leave it as the, the default color. I'm going to grab some... Uh, what's the cobble... Compressed. Compressed cobblestone. It looks a little different than the normal stuff. So we'll grab like three stacks or four or five or whatever. And we have a pickaxe on us. Let's put away all the other loot we got while we were gone. Let's keep the flint and steel on us. We have an emerald shard. We have an iron shard. Dang. We got some decent stuff while being gone. We're going to need to drink... Uh, how much gold do we have? You know what? Do we honestly need a god apple? Let's just take a... Hmm. Hmm. That apple really helped, though. Dang it. I don't know if I need a god apple. That's the only problem. We have a lot of this. Let's just see. Let's, let's evaluate our situation. We have the restoration rod, which I probably should uh, get repaired really quick. And we have these so i think under any circumstance for eight minutes we should be very safe in the nether for eight minutes we should be relatively safe but what i'm gonna do guys is build this little setup and i'll show you guys when it's done and yeah all right dude so i created this little like bunker tank thing and it's filling up here now as you can see we're right above lava it's pumping out of the nether we have a door here so nothing can get in and i just gotta fly out so um where's my oh god okay i have six more minutes worth of that Let's go, like, two seconds, because I don't know how bad this is going to get. We have seven seconds, and YOLO, let's go, low. Let's go, low, let's go, low, let's go, low. Okay, forgot where my base was. All right, it's up here. All right, there we go. So now we have that tank set up. Um, we're probably going to set up more of those as we go along, but that's going to be a decent, hearty amount of nether uh, as we go along. So now that that's pumping like a champion, we have nether whatever going as hard as a mofo. We can actually dump that here, and we shouldn't run out of... Uh, um, is it filling? I think I may have done something wrong here. I don't know for sure. This thing should be emptying, though. Hmm. Hmm. There we go. There we go. It's emptying. There we have it. So now this starts working. Now, as we get more of the lava, this thing will just fill up all the way. Before you guys know it, this thing is going to be filled to the brim. And the reason why it's pumping is because it's pumping into our engines right there, which have tons of juice to work off of. So now that operation is a ghost skis. I think what I'm going to get done right off the cuff, though, is get ourselves a nice little quarry set up here so we can get supplies going. But the thing with that is we have to be mega careful because... Um, if we're not mega careful, what's going to end up happening is, like, we could quarry out too much and then die. So what I'm going to do is get all the basic supplies for a quarry going. And once we have that, we should be good. We may need one more ender tank to run the magmatic engines we're going to have going. Magmatic. We have four. I would, uh, how much ferris ore do we have? No, we have zero. How much invar? Invar. We have 51. So let's go ahead and get some engines made really quick. Let's get, uh... I'd say eight will run a quarry well. What would you guys say? About eight? Let's go iron. Let's go ahead and go like that. Let's go bam, 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 bam. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, let's go with five more. 
Uh, wait, no, 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 because that's only going to make a few. So let's go uh, in VAR. And we still have to have some change left over. So that's going to make three right there. So let's go ahead and make those three um, Invar thingamadoohickeys really quick. Let's go like that and like that. Bam, bam. And I don't even remember how to do it. Magmatic Dynamo. There we go. And a boom. Okay. Ears. Ears. Where art thou? There we go. And bam. We only got one. We need to make this out of... Yeah. There we go. One, two. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, and one, two. So now we have all of our gear set up. Now we are in Bezelos. So now we have that going for us. We have everything really, 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 really set up. Now let's go check our magmatics in here. I think we may actually have seven now, which is still good. We're going to have one on the very tip and then a bunch along the sides. And leadstone energy conduits will have to get going. Let's actually build the quarry. Quarry, uh, do we have the diamonds? It takes 11 to make it. So, diamonds. We have nine. Oh, do we have gold? Yes, we do. Okay, so with four gold, what we can do is grab our minium stone. I love this minium stone. It's the greatest thing ever. And one, two. Bam. Did you just see that? We just made it. There it is. It's done. It's gone. It's over. It's never going to cease to exist. We have those extra two diamonds. Now, let's go ahead and make a pickaxe. So we're going to need sticks. There we go. And this is like legit how the game should be played. Diamonds. Bam. We need a pickaxe. Bam. Bam. There we are. Let's see our gold really quick. Because if we don't have a... We have a lot, but it's not ready. So what I'm going to do is pulverize this gold. I'll have all the supplies so I can show you guys the final products of how to make the... Um, quarry and then from there we're going to get it set up and then next episode we're actually going to get the power running into this thing and then we're going to be good and once we get the power run in we should be able to quarry out this entire area all the way out to bedrock level in a 50, uh, 64 by 64 spot and we should have a crap ton of supplies before it's over all right i'll see you guys on the other side and yeah all right, dude, so I got our, us a quarry. Check it out, check it out, check it out. So what we had to do is we had to make gears. So in order to make an iron gear, what you, here, I'll just run you through it. In order to make an iron gear, what you have to have is cobblestone. And you have to make a cobblestone gear, which is a wood gear, which is sticks. So then with the sticks, you make the cobblestone gear, which is really, really simple. It'll take you like two minutes. Then once you make that, you make the iron gear. From the iron gear, you just add gold in that same sequence, and then you add diamonds in those same sequences. So you're gonna need, um, a lot of iron to be able to make this you're going to need less gold and then you're going to need even fewer diamonds but it, it equals out relatively close because you have this pickaxe then you just need iron and boom you have a quarry now what i would like to do is a quarries a plus quarry quarry plus quarry at some point and it's going to be very expensive to make it because we have to have an assembly table which we don't quite have yet and it, it takes a lot of power to run but what the quarries plus quarry is going to allow us to do is it's going to allow us to do 256 blocks by 256 blocks so basically from here like way out there and it just takes it all out and you can add enchant so you get more diamonds you can add efficiency so it's even faster you can add luck so that you get even more fortune so you get even even more drops it's absolutely insane the type of stuff you can do with it but we just have to get to that point but we're not quite there but we do have our quarry now and we're also going to need to set up the landmarks for this bad boy and get all that going so that's not going to take us too long but we'll make sure to take care of all that in the next episode thank you guys so much for watching i hope that you guys enjoyed finally seeing me getting overpowered it took us forever it took us 11 episodes or 12 or 13 before we even got armor that was good enough that's how you know we suck oh my god it took us forever but now it now becomes the fun part this is where we're going to start fighting bosses i have a huge surprise for you guys next episode and i hope you guys love it but as always don't forget to like comment subscribe if you guys are excited that i finally am overpowered powered i have armor i have ways of survival and everything in between as always it's been your friend mr cynical c thank you so much for watching and as always don't forget to stay cynical i'm out peace